Hello, I'm uh, pleased to come and talk about influenza, and in particular, influenza vaccine. Influenza is a disease that uh, most people give short shrift to. They don't really understand the burden of disease, and so they don't see the need for the vaccine. Well, this has become a real problem. Last year, the 2017-2018 the flu season in the U.S., 80,000 Americans died and 1 million were hospitalized. That's not unique to the U.S. That plays out every year in every country. It's just that they don't measure it, and so they're not aware of it. But we have a very good option, and those are influenza vaccines. Now, one of the things that's particularly uh, pressing is that we are living in an aging, graying world, what's been called the silver tsunami. Actually, interestingly enough, I'm in Italy today, and in uh, two decades, Italy becomes the oldest country in human history. Half of the people will be age 60 and older. What's important about that in terms of influenza prevention is that age group is the age group that has the most morbidity and mortality. They're the ones that die as a result of influenza or have complications. Well, we have options now that are available. We have a high-dose influenza vaccine, we have a recombinant influenza vaccine, and we have the so-called MF59 adjuvanted vaccine. Those are important because they have been demonstrated to decrease the risk of hospitalization and death by 50 to 70 percent, substantially reduce the risk of myocardial infarction, CVA strokes, hospitalization, ICU admission, etc. Pneumonia is another complication of influenza that's considerably reduced by use of the vaccine. Influenza is an important and serious disease. It causes substantial morbidity and mortality, and we have ways of preventing that.